we are kicking off our top 10 countdown of today's must-see, must-share stories with a bang, as in the Big Bang Theory. The ladies are away, the boys will play. Anything can happen. It's gonna get crazy. Dungeons and Dragons! <laughs> TV's most popular sitcom celebrated today when it was nominated for a Golden Globe for Best Comedy TV Series. And just hours later, SBT producer Mar Raphael went on the set of the show in Hollywood where the cast was indeed celebrating. Best television series, comedy, or musical. The Big Bang Theory. Congratulations. Thank so you. So exciting. Uh, thank you, thank you. So we were all sleeping or watching uh, HLN Showbiz tonight when this came yeah. on. Was I the only one awake? Yes, yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You were asleep. Uh, yes, I mean, I woke up shortly thereafter, but uh, but yes, I was asleep. Oh my God. What? <laughs> when I came out to do this interview, I was in the Showbiz Tonight oh, newsroom, and I said, I'm going to talk to the cast of The Big Bang, and they said, they are the ultimate dorks. Oh, that is so awesome. Nice. Is that Thanks for sharing. Not what I thought you were going to say. Yeah. Best compliment ever. <laughs> Actually, not you, Kelly, not you. Thanks. Oh, no, thanks. I, 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 I want to be part of that. So are you dorks in real life? Is there anything? I hear anything? what my wife said about you when we were nominated. <laughs> <laughs> so do, are any of you guys dorks in real life? Like, what are the dorky things no, you do in real life? super cool. Any secrets about how nerdy you are offset? I'm not talking to you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is amazing. Seven seasons. I mean, you are so beloved. And people are going to be growing up with you and watching you on reruns. And it's really special. I mean, is this just an amazing feeling? Yes, yeah. And, and things like, you know, being on the air for so long and things still going well at this stage of events as it were it's just it is it's very special and it's kind of hard to get your wrap your whole mind around that you know and i just think we just come in and we do the show every week and i think we're all very grateful that it's going as well as it is on so many levels get closer I, I need to see <laughs> no, seriously can you get i need to see like actually up his nose <laughs> it's like we're on call. ultimate close up this is investigative journalism. <laughs> you were up a little after five. Yes, a little after five. Yes, it's so cute. Every year we get, you, you wake up and you either get a million text messages or none. So this morning there were a million text messages. And I think after seven years it feels so good. Like people, they're still liking us and it's really nice. So when you first went to your first Golden Globes, you were sort of placed in the back. You think you'll get a better seat this time? We no, were actually just not. talking about that. Our first time <laughs> we ever went, we literally were in the kitchen, basically. Yeah. Yeah. Literally sat in the kitchen, but realized how great it was because the, all the big celebrities had to pass us to get to the stage. Yeah. So, like, all of a sudden we were like, this is the best. Like, we were saying how Brad Pitt was, like, leaning against our chair trying to get past us. Did but anyone we push their seats, like, further and further against the yeah. wall so people would have to climb over yes. us? Yeah, so yeah. That was, I, did, yeah. Well, I did that. So we actually liked sitting in the kitchen. Yeah. Glass half full. And it must be nice to all sit together as a cast. I mean, you are a cast that has great chemistry, pardon the pun. How does that feel? It's amazing. And the alcohol at the Golden Globes helps a lot and helps us get along a lot better. So do you know what you're wearing? Any of you? I hear you might already have a dress. Here it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is cable. Yeah, baby. Um, actually, I do know what I'm wearing. It's crazy. I, I, I said I, I hope I didn't jinx it. Well, I didn't, obviously, well, obviously but I was no, afraid that I did. Yeah. I know. I saw one dress, and I said, if we get nominated, I'm wearing that. And that's all. No more fittings. Done. Now I stop eating. Going to fit in it. It's going to be great. And you didn't jinx it. No. Nope. I slept in my tuxedo last night for good luck. So. <laughs> well, it worked. Yeah. It worked. I wish you kept it on. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> superstition I have. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Best performance by an actor in a television series, comedy, or musical. Jim Parsons, The Big Bang Theory. So congratulations to you. Thank you very This is much. super exciting, and you have a yeah. great category with so many amazing people in yeah. your category. Who do you think is your biggest competition? Oh, God, they're all really, really good. I mean, you know, and there's a lot of still really, really good people that aren't even on the list for, for some strange reason. It's just, um, it's always a surprise, and it's always it's always very special, you know, and um, I don't know, I don't, I don't wish ill for any of them yet. Yeah. Jim's gonna win. Oh, shut up. <laughs> No, we don't want to jinx James, anything. We don't want to jinx everything. That's why he doesn't have an outfit now you have, yet. You, got a dress. Oh, yeah. you don't have an outfit yet because you don't want to jinx it, right? <laughs> yeah, right. That's it. Yeah. What about the food? Is the food any good? Yeah. Not so much. Uh, <laughs> we, I, don't know. I don't know. I don't remember last year. When you have enough champagne, everything you know, you can gnaw on the the cloth napkins, and it, it, it it's good. Right. Lots of booze. It doesn't matter yeah, what the food is. The kitchen, so we know what goes on. <laughs> Beverly Hilton. I love that they said that they like sitting next to the kitchen. We'll have to see how that goes this year. Well, the Big Bang Theory is facing some serious competition in the best comedy series category. Brooklyn Nine-Nine's nominated, Girls, Modern Family, and Parks and Recreation. Good luck to everybody.